Hey everybody, welcome to Build Fly Go. So in the series that we did on how-tos on riveting, one thing I didn't cover is back riveting. So the idea behind back riveting is you have uh, something that you're going to rivet and um, usually it's a long surface, uh, usually like a flap or an aileron or something, um, where you can lay it down, lay it flat on a big sheet of metal, and I will insert a picture of what that looks like. But also, um, it's become common for the top skins on the wings. And the reason for that is it provides a much flatter, um, I guess, surface around the rivets than you usually see. Uh, if you do regular riveting, um, there's always going to be a little bit of a dip right where that rivet is, uh, just because of the pounding on the rivet. But back, back riveting doesn't do that. So you use a back rivet set on the rivet gun. So the back rivet set is just a little spring-loaded uh, piece of plastic around the rivet set, which pushes down the skin. So if we come up here real quick, you'll notice uh, on this overlap, what I would do is I would push down on it until it touches the, the shock side of the rivet. And then on the other side, let's go around to the other side, we would use, in this case, a big back rivet set, a big back rivet bucking bar, which is an incredibly heavy bucking bar. I don't have any of my other ones out here. They're all on the other side. Um, this, I believe, is a five, five or six pounds, so it's really heavy. It's much heavier than the little tungsten ones that I have that are about a pound, pound and a half. Um, this is just regular steel. Um, I can't afford a tungsten one this, uh, this, this big. Um, and you just hold the flat side of it against the rivet, you put the rivet in and then you hold it. And then on the other side, you back rivet it. Um, you've probably seen in the videos for this week that uh, that's all we did all along here. And you might be able to tell, so the ones in the middle, right, the these columns and the row of the stringer are really smooth, they're really flat. But if you look at the ones up here, they're not quite as flat, right? There's a little bit of a, a reflection of the waviness where it was riveted because this line we regular riveted and the crosses we back riveted. So that's it. Um, one more uh, riveting how to back riveting. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe.